Hi there. This is Ryan Malloy here at the Worldwide Center of Mathematics. In this video, I'm going to explain the process of synthetic division. So suppose that we're given some polynomial. Let's say x cubed minus 12x plus 6. And we're going to divide that by some monomial of the form x minus a, where a can be any constant. Here we're just going to do 3 to make our lives a little easier. So the setup for synthetic division may look a little weird, but it does work quite nicely. Here we're going to write our value of a, in this case 3. Note that if this were x plus 3, the sign would change to a minus here. Then we're going to write our coefficients along the top. 1 is the coefficient of x cubed. 0 is the coefficient of x squared. Minus 12 is the coefficient of x. And 6 is our constant. Now from here, we're going to bring down our first number. Multiply 3 by that number and write it here. Then perform addition. Next, multiply 3 by this number and write it here. And perform addition again. Minus 12 plus 9, negative 3. 3 times minus 3 is minus 9. And again, we perform addition. And once again, we get negative 3. So from here, the way that we interpret this result is we subtract 1 from our leading power, and that this will be the coefficient of that. x squared plus 3x minus 3. And then this we'll write as minus 3 over x minus 3, which is the same as the denominator that we started with. So using synthetic division, we found that this expression is equivalent to this. My name is Ryan Malloy, and we've just explained the process of synthetic division. 